Good morning everyone. So I'm just finishing up feeding everybody before I head off to the gym. And it's so early. It's not early. It's like only 7.37. So it's not super early, but I'm not a morning person. A lot of people think I am, but I really am not. I hate the morning. Like, I love the nighttime, but because of my job, I have to be up early. So I have to just suck it up and, like, deal with it. But I'm really not a morning person. If it wasn't for coffee and just the outlook of Friday is just around the corner, I probably would just be like, no. No. Unfortunately, I can't just quit my job because my job's not like that. But my job has a lot of great sides to it, so I don't hate it. I just hate early mornings. Uh, are you a morning person or are you a night person? Like, leave it in the comments. Tell me, are you guys morning people or night people? Would you rather be up all night playing video games or talking on the phone? Or would you rather be up early in the morning and watch the sunrise. See, the one thing I really don't like about driving in the morning, because it never fails, I always get the, like, the sun right in my eyes and I can't see. And it bothers me a lot. I really hate it when it's like the sun's right in my eyes and I can't see. Like right now I have my visor down. You can see that I have my visor down. And it still hit me in the eyes because I'm so short. I am so short. Like I can't avoid the sun in my eyes while I'm driving. It is painful, like the ultimate pain of driving is driving with your eyes, so, like the sun in your eyes, like at sunrise or sunset, either one, when it's right in your eyes and you can't see, I hate it so much, but then, you know, after that, I'm, I'm fine, I love driving, I, I love going on road trips, it's like one of my favorite things to do. <sighs> finally, it's Friday, I'm finally off work. So now I can start my weekend. It's probably going to be whew, a little chill weekend. Um, boyfriend has to work tonight, so it, Friday night is all about me and the animals. And since I'm finally like changed and you know out of my yucky work clothes, I finally get them fed and I don't know, maybe go to the park or something, give them some time to run off some of this extra energy. I mean, you know, it's pretty hard being that adorable and that crazy. What do you, what do you got? Hold on a second. What is this? What is this? Star, what do you got? Let me see that. What are these? Oh, these are squeakers. You finally destroyed your squirrel! Look at this! You've murdered the squirrel! Like, he's not even... Look at this. This is like Star's favorite toy. She's finally destroyed it. Oh, it could have been Kana. Could have been both. Look at what you did to the squirrel. Look at what you did to the squirrel. I guess she can play with it now. I don't care if they play with like stuffingless toys. I just don't like them playing with the stuffing. <sighs> okay, I guess it's time to feed the crazy critters. Yeah, I'm talking about you. I'm talking about you guys. Are you guys hungry? Hi, Lily. Say hi, Lily. Oh, hello. Okay, it's time to feed them. So let me feed the animals and then we'll see about going to the park. Okay, everybody's been fed. Kinda likes to run off with her food. I don't know why, but she doesn't like eating in her kennel. She doesn't like like her food being outside the kennel. It it's weird. And then we have Lily. Is it yum yums? Lily thinks it's yum yums. I don't blame her. And the dragon already got fed earlier, so. 
She's just kind of hanging out. That's up, Peach. So once the kids are fed, or finished eating rather, then I think it'll be time to go to the park, let them play, and I don't know. I think tonight might be a video game night. So you guys can join me. Okay, so we're about to head to the dog park. Got the girls in the back. Say hi, Kana. Star's back there too somewhere. Star, where you at? Star, where you at? Star. She's checking out the stuff in the back that I got back there. Anyways, we're heading off to the dog park and we'll see you there. back from the dog park. Uh, I forgot my wallet in the car, so I gotta go grab that real quick. Um, so I was playing with Star, the corgi, and uh, sure enough, probably the worst luck I have, because all my luck is, seems to be pretty bad, uh, she jumped up and she actually grabbed my thumb pretty good and took off a big chunk of skin. So I was bleeding and gross. Um, So, I gotta clean that up now. Um, we played until it was like dark. We were there for about two hours. Ah, oh, there's my car. Yeah, I, I have a Ford Fiesta because it's the party car. No, I like it and it was pretty cheap. Got a brand spanking new for a decent amount. So, I have a Ford Fiesta. I love it. Um, any Fiesta owners out there? Thumbs up for Fiesta owners. Um, we had a lot of fun, played with this German Shepherd Poodle Mix, so cute, it was an accident dog, but, uh, so super cute, and she was like a huge peacekeeper, like, her name was Ella, it's probably the cutest thing ever, I, I, I can't get over it, she's like a year old, and now we're going back up the stairs, now watch, this is my favorite thing. Like, I just came inside for, like, I've been outside for two minutes, and they were just so happy to see me. Cat's somewhere. She thinks she's a dog. Oh, there she is. Lily! Did you not want to say hi? Okay, so I'm going to show you my thumb. They have running water at the dog park, so. Squeaky toys everywhere. So... Here's my thumb. It's not that bad. Whoa, this focus, man. It's not like super bad. But my thumb's actually swollen, so it sucks. So I gotta clean that up. And then I think I'm gonna play some video games, because after the week I've had, video games are much needed. So, see you in a little bit. Okay, I think it's time for me to go to bed. We're uh, probably going to go to a haunted house tomorrow. I'm going to have my friend Nicole over. So it's going to be a lot of fun. I might get some uh, footage of that. And maybe have a double upload this weekend. Uh, here's to hoping. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.